everyone. My name is Kiki Chang. I am a member of the Scientific Advisory Board for the International Bipolar Foundation. And I'll be answering questions from the perspective of someone who researches childhood bipolar disorder as well as treats children and families who have bipolar disorder. The question is, what causes childhood bipolar disorder? Obviously, that's a very, very big question with no simple answer. We do know that this is a highly heritable disorder, which means there's a strong genetic component to the disorder. However, just because you have a genetic predisposition by having family members with a disorder, it doesn't mean that as a child you will definitely develop a disorder. So we think there are secondary events that occur to then lead to development of mood dysregulation and eventually full mania and depression. And those secondary events could be things such as stress, so stress in the environment, or family stress, or trauma. They might even be things that cause inflammation, such as infections or toxins, but that's a little more controversial. However, whatever reason, this leads to a biological change and enforces pathways in the brain that lead to mood dysregulation and depression and mania. And thus, that's how we feel that bipolar disorder is generated. 